Hello all. In this session, we'll discuss about the two important registers of your 8051 microcontroller related to the interrupts, which are interrupt enable and interrupt priority registers of 8051. So as you know, the interrupt enable register. So interrupt enable register, as the name says, it is used to enable or disable interrupts. So we all know that 8051 has 5 interrupts which are external timer 0, external interrupt 0 which is your INT 0, timer 0, INT 1, timer 1 and serial port interrupt. So these are the 5 interrupts. So these interrupts can be enabled or disabled by using the interrupt enable register. By placing a 0 you disable it and by placing a 1 you enable it. By placing or we can also write it as when you set the bit it is enable and when you reset or clear. When you reset or clear it is disable. And very importantly interrupt enable register is a special function register. And the address of it is A8H. And it is bit as well as byte addressable register. So if you see the bit structure of your interrupt enable register. So as I told you 5 interrupts. So when it is equal to 1 and when it is equal to 0. So EX0 enable external interrupt 0 whenever it is whenever it is equal to 1 it is enabling and low value whenever it is equal to 0 it is disabling and timer 0 interrupt whenever it is equal to 1 enabling equal to 0 disabling and again int 1 bar int 1 bar so to enable make it 1 to disable make it 0. Same way timer 1 interrupt enable disable. Enabling means setting disabling making it 0. Serial port interrupt enable and disable and EA enable all. So using this so all the bits will be enabled all the interrupts will be enabled and all the bits will be corresponding bits will be equal to 1. So enabling or disabling all the interrupts can be done by EA. So if it is EA if it is equal to 1 it enables all the interrupts and whenever it is equal to 0 it disables all the interrupts. So using interrupt enable register we can individually enable or disable the interrupts as well as on the whole all the interrupts can be enabled or disabled. So going with the interrupt priority register. So interrupt priority register as the name says it is used to assign the priorities to the interrupts. So we know that there are 5 interrupts, your INT 0, this is your assigning priority to the INT 0, priority of timer 0, INT 1 priority and timer 1 priority and your serial port. So the main purpose of the inter priority register is to store the priority levels of each interrupt. It stores 
priority levels of each interrupt it is a sfr again bit as well as byte addressable and its address is b8h and if you see the bit description or the bit details so when you set it to 1 set 1 level priority of external interrupt so whenever you give place a 1 it is setting up the high priority and whenever you are making it zero then you are assigning the low priority always the one indicates the high value otherwise the high value indicates the highest priority and the zero indicates the lowest priority so to the interrupts int 0 timer 0 int 1 timer 1 and serial port so whichever you want to give a higher priority you can place a 1 in that particular bit position when you want to give a lower priority keep a 0 and now for example if you make all the five interrupts high then what happens is that it goes for the default so by default you all know that int 0 will have the highest priority and then t not then so this is how the highest priority the priority is increase the top priority is given to int 0 so whenever one or two interrupts are given then it checks for the priority levels but whenever all the five interrupts are given with the highest priority then always remember the default values will be taken so when all the five interrupts are in same priority level and if all the priority if all the interrupts are enabled then the sequence of the interrupts will be this one and which is a by default even though you don't program it these are the by default interrupt priorities so in this session we discussed about the interrupt enable register and the purpose of it interrupt priority register and the purpose of the register along with their bit description thank you all